master web development with Skill Bakery. Hey everyone! Ready to level up your web dev skills? Introducing SkillBakery.com premium courses starting at just $6 or 500 rupees. Sign up today and learn in-demand skill sets. Unlock your potential today at SkillBakery.com. Hello and welcome to another exciting video. This one will be learning how to automatically delete branches after merging pull requests on GitHub. So here you can see I'm under settings and over here just within the pull request menu option you will have this automatically delete head branches. So if I select this and it's enabled now. Next thing what I'm going to do is I am updating the readme.md file in the div branch and once it's done I'll be committing the same over here as you can see. So the readme file is there and the changes are here. Let's commit to the dev branch and then push to the origin. Once that's done, I'll be coming to pull request and here I'll say new pull request. Once I do that, I need to select a branch with which I can compare the main branch. And here you can see it says able to merge. And then I can just go ahead and say create pull request. Once I do that, you can give it a title like delete dev branch after merge. And here I'll say create pull request. Once this is done, I can go ahead over here and I can choose now merge pull request. And then I can simply say merge pull request and confirm this. Once I do that, it's merging now. And if I go now over here to our code, you just see one branch over here now. Earlier we were having two branches, dev and main. Now we are left with main branch only. So that's how you automatically delete a branch after a pull request.